Dom Critty. What's up, YouTubers? This is Dom Critty doing my review of the Masters of the Universe Revelation Masterverse Classic Tila. Yes, and I finally, fucking finally got it in the mail. This figure I ordered on Amazon. Celebration, everybody, round of applause. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. So, for those of you out there watching this video, I want you all to give me a f lots of fucking likes because I've been waiting fucking two months for this fucking figure to arrive in my hand. And this is why I need the classic Tila so fucking bad. So, please, you guys, like the video right now. This took me a lot of time and money to get this. So, anyway, I'm happy that I got it. I was in a lot of frustration because my life has been pretty fucking crazy right now. But I'm, I know I am swearing right now because I'm, I'm literally a little pissed, but I'm happy that I got it. So, anyway, let's take a look at the package. Here we have the classic Tila in her sexiest outfit. Minus the leotard, but they gave her a skirt. And she's got a head sculpt right there with her long hair down. And there's sword, shield, extra pair of hands. This is actually a different um, company, but I mean, this is Mattel. So um, there's no 30 points of articulation on there, but it's different. But it's just uh, different locations, stuff like that. And different languages that we have Netflix logo. And here we side we have is Tila and the nice artwork right there. And on the back, shows us a lovely picture of Tila without her headband. Yeah, and that's pretty cool. And there's no bio right there. You don't have to pause. But maybe it's the same bio, just like from the, uh, the original Tila from the new version. So other figures including the He-Man, Viking He-Man, Classic Tila, fucking focus camera, Barbarian Skeletor, and Merman. I might pick up Merman when I get a chance. But I'm not going to pick these two up. Alright, let's let this beautiful warrior goddess out of this fucking package. And don't forget, like this video right now. Don't make me mad. Okay, let's get her out. And here we have Tila outside the package with all her glory. And we'll get to the accessories later and let me bring those guys out. There we are. Let's take a closer look at this warrior goddess. Alright. It's getting a little hot in here, guys. I'm sweating right now, so... Whew. Okay. All right, let's see. Let's take a closer look at the figure. Wow. I mean, fuck, wow. This looks just like her. Like, just like she popped out from the TV. Um, yeah, it does. Oh. Is that a tight joint right there? Oh, God. I don't want to... I might... I'm worried about that. I might break... Oh, please don't break. Please don't break. Okay. Okay, well, I might have to get some. I gotta blow dry it. Here's a hair dryer to, to heat it up so I can get it to move. So, anyway. Those eyes look beautiful. The arms, she kind of looks like she's been working out. Yeah, it kind of looks like that. It's pretty cool. She's got orange panties on, but don't be dirty. Soft rubber material so you can get her to move. She's got very good boots in the back. This looks pretty cool at the back side. Yeah, looks very good. All right, let's take a look at some accessories that the classic Tila comes with. She comes with her iconic sword and her golden shield. Her extra pair of head sculpt with her without the crown. And two interchangeable hands, the fist hand and the grip hand. And the grip hand, she has the grip hand on her hand and the relaxed hand. So all you can do is, let's change the head sculpt first. Oh, that's easy to pop out. Okay, so let's put this one on with her, her hair down. Wow, beautiful. Yeah, I like her hair down just like that. It's beautiful in that good way. Uh, let me get some light in here so you guys can see. Yeah, that's super good. That's super gorgeous, so you can see it. See better. Um, so we're going to sw swap the head out, so let's do that. All right, if you like this one better, what what's your guys' favorite? you like the, her hair down or hair up or which kind of tea that you like? So let's, um, so switching out the hands, you can just pop the hands out just like that. You can use the grip hand 
they fit nice and tight just like that. You can fix fit the sword in her hand just like that. You can just like fit it in there. It can fit very nice and tight just like that. And you can fit the shield in her hand like so. But it only works with the with the the relaxed hand better or you can use the grip. But anyway, this is the Tila I wanted for my collection. But I just want Tila to wear like a the snake armor, the cobra armor, and the staff of Ka. That's the kind of Tila I like. I might look at those on eBay. All right, um, let's uh, do a comparison with the other Masterverse figures. Here's a comparison with the classic Tila. Next to is He Man. Man in Arms and the new version of Tila. As you can see, He Man and Man in Arms are pretty much taller than her. And let's compare her with this Tila. She looks a little tall, but she's actually in the exact same size. So um, you can do some swapping with her head sculpt. You can do it just like that. You don't like the hair. You can have her with her hair down. Like that. Like other people on YouTube would do that all the time. Or whatever you want. It's up to you. Here's comparison with Classic Tila. Next to is Mossman, Fisto, and Andra. King Grayskull, Savage He-Man, and Orko. Skeletor, Evelyn, and Beastman. Trapjaw, Triclops, and Spikegore. Faker, Stinkgore, and Scareglow, Skelegod, and last but certainly not least, Battle Cat. And now we're going over articulation. This is so exciting, everybody. All right, so starting from the head, her head can look upward that much. It can look down a little bit. It can pivot. It can go all around 360 right there. It can also pivot from side to side. Her arms do go in and out. It can go all the way around 360 right there. I had to heat it up so it was still tight. So we have bicep swivel right there. We have diaphragm joint right there from the midsection. We have double jointed elbows right there. Wrist hinge. Wrist rotation. Legs can kick forward that far. It can kick back. It can do the splits. Got a thigh cut swivel right there. Double jointed knees. Boot cut swivel. Feet hinge and an ankle pivot. Okay, now that about wraps up my reveal. So overall, I love this figure. I dig it so fucking much. And a lot of you know I've been waiting two months to get this. And I have fucking waited two months. And it's been so fucking frustrated to get this. So anyway, I felt lucky. Now I have it. So anyway... I might think about putting Tila in the, the Cobra armor and holding this, the Staff of Ka. I might order those on eBay. Wish me luck getting those. So I hope it can fit on her. So we'll see. But anyway, if you guys please, please, please like this fucking video right now. Smash that like button. Give my video a thumbs up. And leave a comment down below what you think right now. Because I waited two months for this. Please do. And also subscribe to my channel, ding the bell with every videos I upload, and also share this video with your friends and family or anybody else who loves you. So, anyway, thanks for watching, everybody. Hope you stay safe, and hopefully COVID will be over this time of New Year. So, stay safe and take care.